I just wish they would find a cure for this. Norley Tom Chesson is battling PLS, or primary lateral sclerosis, and this battle started later in life when no one saw it coming. About five years ago, we started noticing some pretty pronounced symptoms. Speech was getting really bad, really slow, really slurred. She would start to fall uh, and then couldn't get up. We had no idea what was going on. Not knowing what was affecting his wife, Mike Tom Chesson had no idea what to do or who to see. Norley's children, John and Courtney, were also frustrated as the disease started taking over their mother. It was really kind of one of those things where it was like, I think me as a child was like, just fix it. You know, we would go and we would do whatever we wanted to do. If we wanted to go get a pedicure, we went. If we wanted to go get ice cream, we went. And now it's not like that. After contacting the MDA, Norley was diagnosed with PLS. And now she's doing what she can to battle the disease. I just can't even put into words the, the difference that MDA have made in, uh, in their diagnosis and treatment and the, the way they coordinate with the St. Joe's uh, rehab here. Three days a week, Norley goes to the St. Joseph Rehab Center in Bryan. She spends most of her time in the gym, but really enjoys her weekly visit to the pool. I really enjoy the pool because I can walk unassisted. I feel like I could run in the pool, but they won't let me. <laughs> Darn those therapists. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> With Courtney by her side, Norley works hard at the rehab center thanks to her biggest motivation, her grandchildren. I would like to be able to be more a part of my grandchildren's lives, but it's so hard. We're just going to have faith that everything's going to work its way out. God won't give us more than we can handle. And we're going to move on, keep going. We know we're getting the best help and the best care because of MDA. We will beat this. It may be a year, it may be two years, but she will walk. To the people sitting watching this, just simply by picking up the telephone, placing the pledge, you are a part of the team that are helping not just us, but families all over the Brazos Valley.